I'm not, I'm not going to smell anymore. <laughs> yeah, no, no, you never know in these days anymore. Right? All right, guys, you were done in here. All right, guys, get out of the house, please. Unless y'all got a warrant or something, well, you need to go. Hold on, we just rested some in here. In a dramatic turn of events, former officer Hannah Couch Brenner lodged a complaint against Florida Police Chief Melanie Bevan, accusing her of improperly detaining and searching two individuals in a home without a warrant. The plot thickens. Decide whether this guy is an absconder or not. And okay. A couple of people sitting up here when we got here, they said he was in the back. Okay. So he's got a girlfriend back there, um, Destiny. Okay. And the girl that was out here said that he's out here. He's always with, he's in always the back. Together. They're always together. She said not a VFO, but he has been, has a history of resisting arrest. She says there's only one way in, one way out. Oh, so he's inside in the back? She says that, and I wanted you here. Detached, just, just in case. In case. I got you. Now, he does have a history of prison and stuff. Uh -huh. I'm not going to take it. I'm going to take it seriously. Of course. Regardless, you know. Yeah. So, How old that's is he? What, uh, probably about my age, probably about 40. Okay. Here we go. Right. Also, McClamour. Okay. Really bad. Mm -hmm. He's an officer. Okay. All right. I just don't have my cool chain. Okay. All right. Sure. As the video kicks off, Chief Bevan appears oblivious to the identities of her fellow officers. For efficient communication, coordination, and safety during police operations, it's crucial that officers are familiar with all the comrades on the scene. Yeah. You want to incognito, right? Did they go through here? You come in. Did they go? Did they go through here though? The cops? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, go through here. You guys can come in. Hi. Right. Come over. Back there. Mm-hmm. You looking for Dre? That's what they're looking for. Do we? Do we know? He, is he in there? I'm not sure. I can't even really be honest. I just have no clue. I just got here to get my granddaughter. Ma'am, can you open the door, please? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Door's open. Hey, we're looking for Andre. God damn, what y'all thinking on my poor like that? Well, we're trying to find Andre. Is Andre Wimberly here? Oh. All right. Is he in the back or? Oh, I heard that. Oh. Having received the green light from the property owner to walk through her house in pursuit of the suspect, the police began snatching IDs and interrogating every person in the home. However, in the U.S., no federal law mandates individuals to carry or display identification to law enforcement officers if they're not suspected of a crime. In this case, the officers already knew who their target was. That's her sister's boyfriend. Okay. Do you mind if I hook? Come in and check for Andre. Hold on. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I don't want to be in the What shop. time is it? I gotta go. Excuse me. Sorry. What time? What time? What time? Yeah, just, just right out here. You can stand. Yeah. I'm not on you. I know. Yes, ma'am. Is Andre in there, bud? What's up? You know, let me know. I'm sorry. 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 i am sorry 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 i and I have access to this house. This is public. It's, uh, no, I verified this residence. I have access to this house. Y'all came in here. I'm being disrespectful. I'm not being disrespectful. You're blocking our way right now. I'm not blocking your way. I'm just trying to on. One persistent officer insisted on entering the premises. If the police possess a valid arrest warrant for the boyfriend, they have the legal authority to enter the home without permission to apprehend him. Of course, this comes with certain rules and procedures, like having a reasonable belief that the boyfriend is inside and usually announcing their presence before barging in. Excuse okay. me, thank you. Oh, thank you. I can have one. Thank you. No. Come to get you And Andre, let's go, man. You guys you still have a unit watching the back? Yeah. Yeah. Um, what is it? Like a pantry? Pantry. Gotcha. Who is that? The fuck? There he is. Hey, Andre. Come on out. Good job. Let me talk to him. Oh, yeah. Come on. Hold on one minute. Let me talk to him. Listen, listen. You didn't even report to me. You just calm down. Okay? <laughs> 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 
Oh. You made me go through all this and get six officers? <laughs> Upon discovery, Andre complied with the police's every demand. Ironically, it was his girlfriend who couldn't stop sobbing, with Andre repeatedly urging her to calm down. Quite the emotional roller coaster. <laughs> Relax, relax, baby, relax, relax, baby. Put your, put, your, put your shoes on first, okay? Relax, Destiny, relax. Put your shoes on, Andre. Relax, babe, come on. I don't care, you don't yes. act like that. Here. Okay. Stop. No! Well, you're just making That's a fucking boy, man! Get me out, though. Get me out! You're praying, okay? <laughs> relax, baby. Relax. Yeah, listen, listen. Right. Hold on. You can Just talk relax. in a minute, all right? Okay. Let's, let's get this done here. Oh, so I'm sorry. Yeah, she'll be here. That's okay. All right, let me double lock her so they don't get tired. Right, no you got his phone number and all that stuff. No, so I need to give him my number. Okay. okay, let's do that. Let's let's do something first. Yeah, do something Free, 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 free. You can't do nothing about him going to jail. It's a breath of fresh air when law enforcement officers treat people as individuals rather than instantly branding them as criminals. This female officer's approach promotes a more positive and respectful interaction between law enforcement and the community. However, while all this was unfolding, Chief Bevan had her own agenda brewing. Just calm down. Yeah. Mm, left my cell phone in the car. <laughs> That way y'all can get in contact with each other when he in there. All right. Hey. Yeah. That's what that is. Yeah, what is that? I'm not, I'm not going to smell it anymore. <laughs> yeah, no, no, you never know in these days anymore. Right? All right, guys, you're done in here. The property owner, now fed up, demanded the officers leave, having found what they were after. But Chief Bevan stubbornly refused, citing officer safety. Let's not forget, though, that they only had an arrest warrant, not a search warrant. All right, guys, get out of the house, please. Unless y'all got a warrant or something, well, you need to go. Hold on. We just arrested somebody in here, so we don't exactly. have to do it quite yet. We don't okay. Have to do it quite okay. Yet. Just stand by. Okay. 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 I mean, I get it that you gotta come in here and do your thing, but like, well, you don't need to be know. searching we're for shit. Searching, we're searching not, we're not searching going through anything. Well, then I guess I agree with what I want to do too, right? I mean, that's picking up shit. Subject for okay. your information, driver's license, not valid, showing a little alarm. They are slops, though. Yes, they are. And Cassie has a marijuana card, so it doesn't matter if you find me. Is that your license plate? Yeah, it's my license plate. Is that your license plate? Yeah, it's my license so they'll have, they have probable yeah. cause already, so but what that means they're not going to search it to see something that's taken. Right. Well, that's what I said. Yeah. I told them, I said, I said we can't search, but always always make sure you have to look around and see what we're, because she got all upset. I said, always make sure you look, search incident to us, but it's not a search. You know? They're clearly hiding stuff. Well, it's for officer safety, we can search the uh, search the media area, check the media area, so. Following a complaint against Chief Bevan for improper detainment and search, the Bradenton City Council approved an independent investigation. However, the inquiry, led by retired federal judge Greg Holder, uncovered no evidence of search and seizure involving any person or property. This just goes to show that letting the police investigate themselves might not be the best idea. 